na to, tara pa, tunututu. Hello and welcome back. Today I'm going to tell you a story about a cute mouse and a cookie. Yeah. This beautiful story is by Laura Joff Numeroff, illustrated by Felicia Bond. What will happen if you give a mouse a cookie? Hmm. Hmm? Hey, come on, kitty. Come on. Come on. He's going to ask for a glass of milk. Well, will you keep your milk? When you give him the milk, then he's going to say bye bye and he will walk away. No, that's not the end of the story. Yeah? Our sticky mm -hmm. mouse is going to look for something mm -hmm. else. Yeah? Hmm? He can't drink. Yeah. Oh, he'll probably yeah. ask you for yeah. a straw. And you have to look for a straw in the cabinet. When he's finished, he will ask mm. for a napkin. Mm. Hmm. He wants to clean his mm. milk mustache. Then he'll want to look in a mirror to make sure he doesn't have a milk mustache. <laughs> okay. You have to take him to the bathroom. When he looks into the mirror, he might notice his hair needs a trim. What will you need if your hair needs a trim? A. A pair of gloves. B. A pair of chopsticks. C. A pair of scissors. Hmm. Oh, no! So, he'll probably ask for a pair of nail scissors. Oh, and you have to go to get them. Hmm. When he's finished giving himself a trim, he'll want a broom to sweep up. He'll start swooping. Oh no, everywhere is messy, full of hair. He might get carried away and sweep every room in the house. He enjoys cleaning, in fact. Meow. He may even end up washing the floors as well. Oh no, swimming time! So he will scrub here, scrub there, and scrub everywhere. When he's done, he'll probably want to take a nap. He's too tired. You will have to fix up a little box for him with a blanket and a pillow. But blanket and a pillow? To that size? Hmm. He'll crawl in, make himself comfortable, and fluff the pillow a few times, just like that. And then he'll probably ask you to read him a story. 
So, you'll read to him from one of your books and he will ask to see the pictures. Hmm, very good listener. He listens carefully. When he looks at the pictures, he'll get so excited he'll want to draw one of his own. He'll ask for paper and crayons. Bam! Oh, what's happening here? Crayons are all over the place. Hmm. Oh, he's drawing something. Oh, he will draw a picture. When the picture is finished, then he might sign his name. Maybe. Oh, okay, yes. He'll want to sign his name. And what will you sign your name with? A. A ruler. B. A pen. C. An eraser. With a pen. So, and the pen is in the boy's rear pocket. Then he'll want to hang his picture on your refrigerator. Hmm, oh no, which means he'll need, uh, he'll need some... What do you think he needs to hang something on the refrigerator? Hmm, A. A pair of scissors. B. A pencil sharpener. C. Scotch tape. Hmm. Scotch tape. Yeah. Smart. Hmm. A tower. Oh. He'll hang up his drawing and stand back to look at it. Looking at the refrigerator will remind him that... Remind him what? Remind him... Oh, he is thirsty. <laughs> Again. And what will he want? What do you think he will ask if he is thirsty? A. A glass of water. B. A cup of tea. C. A glass of milk. Hmm. So? He'll ask for a glass of milk. Oh, no. Not again. Yeah. What are you doing? And chances are, if he asks for a glass of milk, he needs something to go with. What do you think he will need to go with milk? A. A cookie. B. An apple. C. An orange. He's going to want a cookie to go with. <laughs> hey, little chubby mouse. Ooh. Seems like our boy is absolutely tired, which can mean you never give a mouse a cookie. Remember. Right, I hope you enjoyed the story, everybody. And if you like the story, don't forget to drop likes and share the video. And if you haven't subscribed to my channel, don't forget to do it because uh, you kind of get notified by upcoming videos. Don't forget to turn that bell on if you want to get notified. All right, have fun. Till then. Take care. If you give a dog a donut, by Lauren Yumaroff and illustrated by Felicia Bond. Ah. 
what do you think will happen if you give a dog a donut? I've tried many times, but I can't wait to hear and watch the boy's story. Let's find out. Hey, what will happen if you give a dog a donut? Hmm. A. He'll ask for some milk. B. He'll ask for some syrup. Or C. He'll ask for some apple juice. You guessed right. He'll ask for some apple juice to go with. <laughs> Very smart. Dogs drink apple juice, really. And then, uh, when you give him the juice, he'll drink it all up. And uh, what will happen next? I see. Then he'll ask for more. <laughs> He's not going to stop and uh, there won't be any left. So he'll want to make his own. Wait, make his own apple juice? Oh, he'll go outside to pick apples. What are you doing? Clothes are all over the place. Pick his own apples. When he's up in a tree, he'll toss you on one apple. Throwing the apple will make him think of baseball. Hmm. And he'll want to play. What do you need to play baseball? A. A golf club? B. A baseball? C. A shuttlecock? Hmm, where is he going? Oh, you'll have to get a ball. And a glove. What else? Oh, of course, he'll also need a bat. A baseball bat. Don't forget. And he'll ask it to pitch. Oh, the boy must be tired. Oh, I see. And can you believe that? He'll hit the home run. Our puppy is a baseball player. A pretty good at baseball. Bell huh. back at it again. Then he'll do a happy dance to celebrate. How happy dance? Very cute. Dancing will make him hot and dusty, so he'll need some water. He'll probably start a water fight. Oh no! You'll have to draw him off with your bandana. What is he going to do next? Oh, he'll wrap it around his head and pretend that he's a pirate. Rrr, shiver me timbers! Then he'll want to go on a treasure hunt. What is he doing? Oh, he found something. Oh, he'll find an old kite and want to make one himself. But what do you need to make a kite? A. A candy cane? B. A dinosaur? C. Sticks, paper and string. Oh, you'll have to get him some sticks, paper and a string. Hey, you're very smart.
When the kite is finished, he's gonna give it to his friend. No, he's not going to do that. What is he going to do with the kite? Yes, of course he'll want to fly it. And it will go higher and higher until it's gone. <laughs> oh no, until it gets tangled in the apple tree. I see, he's climbing up to fetch it. Will the kite come out in one piece? Let's find out. Yes, when he looks at a tree, it reminds him of apple juice, so he'll probably ask you for some. Oh, what are you doing? And chances are, um, wait a minute, what's happening? What's going on here? Seems like he's chasing somebody. What? Apple? Another one? What's happening? Is that a laundry basket? If he asks for some apple juice, uh, then he'll definitely want something to go with. Guess what? You guessed right. He'll want a donut to go with. Oh, seems like he's very happy. <laughs> hey there, hope you enjoyed this beautiful story by Alora Numeroff. Make sure to push that red button and drop some likes. Till end of the story, end of the animated book, take care. If you give a pig a pancake, what do you think will happen if you give a pig a pancake? By Laura Numeroff, illustrated by Felicia Bond. If you give a pig a pancake, she will ask something sweet to go with. Something like... Candy? No, candy doesn't go well with pancake. What else? Let me think. Oh, something like honey. Or what else? Oh, what is that bottle on the table? No idea. It's too easy to find out. We just flip this page. Oh, she'll want some syrup to go with. So, she jumps right on the coffee table and you'll give her some of your favorite maple syrup. Then, she'll lick it all up and she'll probably get all sticky. Oh, wait, where is she going? What do you do when your hands get sticky? You'll wash them, right? Yes, you will wash them. Now, you may have guessed where she's going. She will want to take a bath. What do you think she will ask you to do next in the bathroom? You've guessed right, she'll ask you for some bubbles. Then. She wants to play with something in the bathtub. What could that be? What do you usually play with in the bathtub? Something like... Um, dolls? Balls? Rubber duckies? When you give her the bubbles, she will probably ask you for a toy. You'll have to find your rubber duck.
The duck will remind her of the farm where she was born. She, oh, she might feel homesick and want to visit her family. She will want you to come too. She will look through your closet for a suitcase. Then she look under your bed. Guess what she will find? When she is, when she's under the bed, she'll find your old tap shoes. So, what do you think she's going to do with them? Guess. She'll try them on. She'll probably need something special to wear with them. When she'll all dressed, she'll ask you for some music. You'll play your very best piano piece and she'll start dancing. What do you think she will do next? Yes, you're right. She will want you to take her picture. So, what do you need to take some pictures? Yes, you'll have to get your camera. When she sees the picture, she'll ask you to take more pictures. What do you think she will do with those pictures? Oh no, then she wants to send one to each of her friends. Headache. What will you need to send letters and pictures to your friends? Yes, you're right. You'll have to give her some envelopes and stamps. And of course, take her to the mailbox. What will happen on the way to the mailbox? Anything could happen. On the way, she'll see the tree in your backyard. So, she'll want to build A. A nest for birds. B. A house. Or C. A tree house, you guess. A, B, or C. Build a nest doesn't make sense. Build a house or build a tree house. Yes, you're right. So, what will you have to get her to build a tree house? Correct. You'll have to get her some wood, a hammer, and some nails. So, what is she going to do next after finishing the tree house? When the tree house is finished, she'll want to decorate it. No. So, she'll ask you for some uh, A. Colored pencils. B. Bananas, bananas, decorating, bananas, or C, wallpaper and glue. Yes, she'll ask you for wallpaper and glue. Bananas. When she hangs the wallpaper, she'll get all sticky, sticky, sticky. When did she get sticky? Oh, remember, when she had some syrup. Feeling sticky will remind her of your favorite maple syrup. Oh, no. And then, of course, she'll probably ask you for some. Some what? Some maple syrup. And chances are... If she asks for some syrup, what will she want to go with it? A. Cookies B. Pancake C. Cake Yes, you're right. She'll want a pancake to go with. Chubby pig. Hey, hope you enjoyed the video and don't forget to leave a like, share it and subscribe to the channel if you haven't. So push that red button now and subscribe in order to get notified of upcoming videos.
and take care.